Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys me packing my swim bag for the upcoming month or so because once I get fully vaccinated, I get to go back to swimming. So many of you may not know this, but I used to do competitive swimming and I trained one year in the city level, so from one to 10. And then I spent one year with a club and then another two years with a different club. And then during ninth grade, I just swam with my school swim team. And then in grade 10, I've just been staying at home due to COVID. Once I'm fully vaccinated, I get to go back to swimming. So I'm gonna show you guys me packing up my bag for the upcoming month or so. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. This is the bag that I use and it is the Teamster Speedo swim bag and I have it in the 35 liter capacity and here's a basic overview of what my bag looks like and I'm pretty sure I have it in the color lime green and then here's just a size comparison Alright, so I have my towel and then I also always put my towel and like my swimsuit and everything into one of these like bags that we get from like going to camps or from like different events. So I have like a ton of these and I always use these to store my towels when I go swimming because I think my bag, like the inside is not clean because I haven't washed it for a long time. So I just keep my towel in here and I'm just going to put it into the main compartment. <laughs> like that and then probably the most important thing are swimsuits so in total i have four right now but all of these are too small for me because i haven't swam in over years i have this arena pink green and purple one it's like really colorful and then it has these words but i've never gotten to figure out what they said i think this is water but everything else i have no idea what it says and then i also have this one this is probably my favorite one it's just like a blue like different shades of blue and then black and the inside is pink and then i also have this one one of my most recent ones it's just a patterned um swimsuit then i also have my racing suit which is really small for me so yeah i usually keep one in my swim bag all right next thing relating to the swimsuit are these sort of mesh bags that you uh put your swimsuit in to wash because your swimsuits are delicate so i put my swimsuit into this bag after i'm done swimming and then i just throw this into the wash so this is gonna go into the main compartment as well so while i was looking for my goggles i found this and it says follow your dreams i made this when i was really young and this is basically all of my swimming related things in here so i have caps goggles ribbons to have a lot of caps goggles and like 10 more caps. All right, so now that I have my goggles, I usually put my main cap and goggles onto this side here. And then I put like extra ones because my caps like sometimes rip or the goggle straps break. I just put extras in here in case they break when I'm swimming. So that's that for the goggles and caps. Next thing I like to keep in my bag are extra elastics and a headband just in case for after practice if my hair is like in my way and then extra elastics just in case the one i'm using breaks so this also goes into the dirt bag basically this is like my, my extra bag like if something breaks next thing is a water bottle this is just a one of those gatorade squirt bottles and i just put this on the side of my bag currently it's empty because i have i don't use this at home and that goes on to the side next thing i like to bring with me to practice are these soaps i guess so this is just a face wash to get the chlorine off my face after practice and then i just have a body wash and then usually i take like a full shower when i come back home so usually i just take a quick shower at the pool and then come back and take a full shower so this goes on to the side of my bag on the other side where it has the larger pocket <laughs> I also have headphones with me almost all the time for those times when I'm walking from home or walking from bus stop to bus stop. I just keep it at the front pocket. in my bag is just a mini coin purse it just carries some change and some cards i have so in the zipper pocket i just have some change for buses or vending machines or when i'm hungry after practice or before and then i also have my bus card that has no money in it and then i also have my swimming card from 
the last time I swam, which was like one year ago. And I also have a Dairy Queen gift card and also a Starbucks gift card and a one of those McDonald's coffee sticker collecting cards. And this is just a coach coin purse, I guess. And it's basically like a keychain. And I put it at the front of my bag. <laughs> And then I have my foot flops. These go into the bottom pocket of the bag. Next thing that actually came with the bag, um, I don't actually pack it specifically to go to practice, but in the back, it sort of has like a laptop compartment, but it's actually for one of these. Basically just a pad you sit on, on like wet surfaces. And it also keeps the bag's shape. Um, yeah, this is really useful for sitting on those stands at like swim meets or just practice in general. So that concludes the end of this week's video of me showing you guys packing my swim bag. So I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next week.